U.S. Navy New Hypersonic Upgrade Does the USS Zumwalt truly live up to its reputation as a symbol of innovation and power in naval warfare, or are there inherent risks and limitations to its cutting-edge technology? How does its futuristic design impact its practicality and effectiveness in real-world combat scenarios? And in an era of evolving global security challenges, can the USS Zumwalt maintain America's dominance on the oceans? Or are there emerging threats that may challenge its supremacy? Join us on a quest to delve deeper into the intriguing story of this enigmatic warship and critically examine the groundbreaking features that define the USS Zumwalt's place in the ever-changing landscape of naval engineering and geopolitics. Startup and Manufacturing One of the most groundbreaking features of the USS Zumwalt is its stealthy design, inspired by the radar-evading principles of the F-117 Nighthawk, the iconic stealth aircraft. This radical departure from conventional ship design posed a unique set of challenges, as the vessel needed to combine stealth with the versatility and firepower expected of a destroyer. To achieve this, the USS Zumwalt employed cutting-edge technologies and materials, including a wave-piercing tumble-home hull, advanced radar-absorbing materials, and a low profile that minimized its radar cross-section. These innovations allowed the ship to operate in hostile environments while remaining virtually invisible to enemy radar systems. The ship's armament was equally impressive. The USS Zumwalt was equipped with the Advanced Gun System, or AGS, a pair of 155mm guns capable of launching precision-guided projectiles over vast distances, providing unparalleled firepower. Additionally, it featured vertical launch systems, or VLS, cells for Tomahawk missiles and other advanced munitions, further enhancing its offensive capabilities. As the USS Zumwalt's construction advanced, the ship garnered attention not only for its formidable technology, but also for its unique and striking appearance. Its angular, futuristic design earned it nicknames like the Battleship of the Future and the Stealthy Ghost of the Seas. This iconic look, a blend of form and function, further cemented the vessel's status as a symbol of innovation. With its maiden voyage in 2019, the USS Zumwalt began a new chapter in naval history. It represented a quantum leap forward in naval technology, ushering in a new era where stealth, precision, and adaptability would reign supreme. As it patrolled the world's oceans, the USS Zumwalt showcased the United States' unwavering commitment to maintaining its naval dominance and readiness to face any challenge the future might hold. USS Zumwalt Mississippi Home Port Shift The USS Zumwalt DDG-1000, a formidable guided missile destroyer, has found itself in an unexpected pit stop, right in the heart of sunny San Diego. This unplanned detour came on the heels of a grand departure, as the ship set out for the Ingalls Shipbuilding Facility in Mississippi with the mission to receive a high-tech makeover. The initial plan was nothing short of impressive. The USS Zumwalt was en route to Ingalls Shipbuilding to undergo a transformation of epic proportions, involving the installation of a state-of-the-art hypersonic missile system. This upgrade promised to enhance the ship's firepower and tactical capabilities to a whole new level. However, fate had other ideas. The mighty vessel, which had set sail with great anticipation, made an unexpected U-turn and returned to port in San Diego due to a mysterious maintenance issue. It seems even the most advanced warships can encounter a hiccup or two on their journeys. Missiles Upgrade Once the USS Zumwalt finally reaches its destination at Engall's shipbuilding, a meticulous operation awaits. The ship's twin 155mm advanced gun systems will be removed, making way for the installation of four formidable 87-inch missile tubes. These tubes will house the Common Hypersonic Glide Bodies, or CHGB, a cutting-edge addition to the ship's arsenal. What's truly captivating is the potential firepower this modification offers. Each of these missile tubes is poised to carry not one, not two, but three missiles creating a staggering total of 12 missiles per Zumwalt destroyer. The very thought of such firepower on a single ship is enough to command respect and attention. But the USS Zumwalt is just the beginning of this grand upgrade plan. 
The Navy has ambitious intentions to bestow similar enhancements upon its siblings. USS Michael Monsoor DDG-1001 and Lyndon B. Johnson DDG-1002, both of which will undergo their own impressive transformations at the Ingalls facility. In the race to equip the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 with cutting-edge hypersonic weaponry, the US Navy is on a mission to redefine naval firepower. With an ambitious goal to have the Zemwalt-class destroyer ready to deploy these game-changing weapons by 2025, the Navy is pushing the envelope of technological integration. The centerpiece of this transformation is the Common Hypersonic Glide Body, or CHGB, a collaborative endeavor between the Navy and the Army. The plan is to outfit the Zumwalt-class destroyers with long-range conventional prompt strike weapons, marking the quickest route to incorporating hypersonic capabilities. These hypersonic weapons promise to revolutionize the Navy's strategic capabilities, offering unmatched speed and precision. But as with any ambitious endeavor, there are hurdles to overcome. The Government Accountability Office GAO, has raised concerns about potential delays in fielding these hypersonic weapons. Delays in the development of the CHGB have cast shadows of doubt on whether the Navy's timeline can be met. If the hypersonic weapon is not ready for integration during the planned maintenance period, the Navy might need to make adjustments to their schedule or wait for the next opportunity. Nonetheless, the Navy remains undeterred in its pursuit of hypersonic supremacy. The shipyard entrusted with the monumental task of installing these futuristic missiles on the USS Zumwalt was awarded a substantial $154.8 million contract. The preparation for this upgrade began earlier in the year with a $10.5 million planning contract for the USS Michael Monsoor DDG-1001, demonstrating that the Navy's ambitions extend beyond a single ship. The stakes are high and the timeline is ambitious. The Navy is not only looking to outfit the Zemwalt-class destroyers, but also has plans to deploy these hypersonic weapons in the Virginia payload module of the Block 5 Virginia-class attack submarines by 2029, ensuring that this technological leap will have a profound impact on the entire fleet. In the world of naval warfare, innovation is the key to maintaining superiority, and the Navy's commitment to integrating hypersonic weapons is a testament to that spirit. As challenges arise, the Navy is prepared to adapt and overcome, driven by the relentless pursuit of a more powerful and versatile naval force. The future of naval warfare is unfolding before our eyes, and the USS Zumwalt is at the forefront of this transformative journey. That was all for today, folks. What do you think about this transformative journey of naval warfare? Are you excited about it? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. And don't forget to like and subscribe.